A reminder of that breaking news in the last hour. Czech police have said that people have been killed and injured in a shooting near a university in central Prague. Authorities have said that the incident is continuing and has urged citizens to stay away from the scene and remain indoors. Uh, joined now by the journalist based in Prague, Philippe Hawkey. Philippe, good afternoon to you. Good afternoon from Prague. Nice to have you with us. Um, can you tell us a little more about what you're hearing there in Prague at the moment and what has happened? Well, there are informations which are confirmed. So right now we know that the shooter has been neutralized. We know that there, there are a number of uh, people dead and dozens of injured. Just a short time ago, there was a tweet by the official uh, ambulance authority of Prague. They have just tweeted that we have confirmed a uh, big number of, uh, or a huge number of uh, injured. Um, people are uh, people are under, injured critically and also lightly. So these are just just breaking informations which are coming to us uh, from from the official authorities, Czech Prime Minister and Minister of Interior uh, heading to the scene. What we know so far that there has been a shooting inside the Charles University uh, building. Uh, I have to remind you that there, uh, there, it's it's a Christmas time, and this building is in the very city center of Prague. So it's just let's say three minutes by walk from the old town square, where the very famous astronomical clocks. Uh, on three minutes by walk, on the other side from the building, there is a Charles Bridge. So it's the very city center. But it's very surprising that this kind of stuff has happened in Prague because I have to remind you that the Czech Republic is one of the safest countries in the world. And I was a journalist for many years uh, uh, in my past, and I've covered this kind of uh, stories, uh, especially in the Western Europe. But it's very surprising that something like that has happened inside the Czech Republic, because as I said, this kind of uh, events is very, very uh, unique here. We've heard that uh, at this moment, uh, we know that uh, the sure has been neutralized. There are unconfirmed information uh, that he has killed himself. Uh, we, we there were also info, informations that uh, the students and and other personnel who has been inside the faculty building uh, heard dozens of shoots. Uh, I've re read a tweet uh, by one of the students who was there inside the building, and he wrote that they were uh, locked. Uh, inside their classroom uh, and they were ready uh, to attack. If anyone tried to uh, get inside uh, their classroom, they put the furniture just behind the door uh, to make it even more uh, tough and difficult for uh, the attacker to get inside. Uh, people are still uh, going out from the building. I'm just now watching the public TV broadcast and we can see that there is a I don't know how to call it actually in English, but imagine it I like a snake of people with uh, having hands on the shoulders of people in front of them. And they're just leaving, I would say, probably one of cafes or hotels inside the city center. Uh, so uh, we know that the sugar has been neutralized. Um, there is no uh, there is no other particular danger. A minister of interior confirmed that there is no other second uh, attacker or something like that. But the scene is, is, is still uh, developing and it's it's a, Indeed. it's a huge information. So we, we know that, uh, from what you're telling us, uh, the, the, this was a lone gunman acting on his own who, we understand, took his own life in this uh, shootout, culminating in his own death. Do we know how many people have been killed? <laughs> Sorry, sorry for interrupting you, but 20 seconds ago, we we have now first numbers by the uh, Prague ambulance uh, uh, official Twitter account, and it says that there are 11 dead, including the attacker, nine critically injured, five to six person with uh, the uh, let's say average uh, level of injuries and uh, 10 slightly injured numbers are still uh, can change this is this is this is just right uh, right now ongoing uh, that, that's just 20 20 seconds ago uh, okay. this this uh, information has been tweeted by by Czech authorities okay Philip thank you uh, for your time sir so stay safe Philip Hawkey uh, with us in Prague uh, he was just telling us there that, according to the latest information, he has 11 dead, nine very seriously injured, and 526 people with some kind of... I think he might have used the word minor or average injury there.
Uh, but that is the latest from Prague. And of course, more on that breaking story as it comes.